Joy friends. I hope you are all doing well. I am excited to finally share some happy mail that I received from Pam from Be Creative Crafts. This is way overdue. And so Pam, please forgive me for being so long in sharing, but do know that you touched my heart more deeply and profound than you could ever imagine. And as you guys get to watch and see the love and the thought and the care that went into each of these items that she sent me, no doubt, if you truly know me, as she clearly does, each and every one of these gifts was truly bought for me in mind. Pam, you touched my heart. You also touched my eyes. You wet my eyes, my friend. That's right. I cried tears of laughter and tears of joy, and I'm really bummed that I did not do a video reveal when I actually opened this. Unfortunately, at that time, I was sick with the flu, but it brought so much joy to me as I opened it and felt the heartfeltness of everything in it. But there is one item that touched me more than anything else. It will be an item that probably will surprise you, Pam, and will surprise all of you, my joy friends, that it was the one that touched my heart the most. But I will reveal that um, at the very end and tell you why. But Pam, thank you so much from the bottom of my heart for all of these wonderful gifts. Now, taking forever to get this unboxing done or this share or whatever you want to call it, trust me, the punishment was more on me because I've had to wait to enjoy these things until I could share. So without further ado, let me show you. So first off, she sent me this really cool card and it had this really nice matching envelope. And if you know anything about me, I actually am a very big plaid fan. I love plaid. So I love that, Pam. But the card says, Merry Christmas. And if y'all know anything about Miss Pam, she loves the little red trucks. So I love that. All right. And it says, hoping this wondrous Christmas season delivers the joy of giving and peace everlasting. Love, Pam. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. I hope you had a wonderful holiday. I hope this box of goodies brings you joy. If it's not something you want or can use, please feel free to sell, gift, add to the traveling box of joy, or whatever you'd like. Nugs, my friend, uh, Pam from Be Creative. And she says, be creative and happy crafting. So, um, yeah, none of this am I going to sell, give away, or even put in the traveling box of joy. I'm just going to be selfish that way. All right. The first thing I'm going to show you is this really cool sign, and it says, Be happy, choose joy. And no doubt, this is going to be on display somewhere back there on that wall, so that it can be seen and as a reminder that we do all need to be happy and choose joy. Absolutely love that, Pam. All right. The next thing is, you guys, look at these cool calendars. Isn't that awesome? Choose joy. I absolutely love it. And I already have a place right over here in my little organization corner where Mr. Joyful is going to help me get it hung as soon as this video is over. So, yay. <laughs> All right. Now, you know, your girl had to throw a little bit of yarn in here, right? Um, and so she sent me this really wonderful Sugar Wheel Cotton Solid Yarn Bee. And it's in this beautiful color. And they call this Pink Canyon. And it just so happens, Pam, that I have some really cool towels that are done in like an aqua teal in pink. I actually have one I can show that this cotton yarn will be perfect for. Let me grab this uh, dish towel real quick. Look at this. Look at this dish towel. So how perfect this cotton yarn is going to go for those towels. Love it. <laughs> All right. There's more. You guys, look at this gorgeous box. Like, there's so much about it. I love flowers. I love butterflies. 
I love joy. Live life joyfully. All right. Whoops. Look at the top. Is that not awesome? And that's the sound of joy. <laughs> or a type of joy. All right. Inside, I have butterfly stickers. And so Pam has shared these with me. And some of you I will share them with when I send you cards and letters. So thank you, Pam. Then look at this little mini um, magnet. It says, choose joy. How cool is that? Well, I have a metal arm that holds my camera and I'm actually gonna put this on that arm so that every time I am with all of you, Pam will be reminding us all to choose joy. So even though you won't see it, I will see it and I will feel Pam's love. All right. Then I got these really cute, they're gift bags. They're little burlap gift bags, right? Oh, wait. Oh, no. You know what these are? How cool is that? It's like pennants. They're like pennants. So they have these hearts on them, and they'll fan out like a pennant. Isn't that cool? I love that. All right. And then she sent, oh, well, you know what? So the Traveling Joy Box is going to come back to me. So I am going to put one of these in there. I am going to share one. She sent me some of these puzzles. And isn't that cool? So I'm going to keep one for myself for Mr. Joyful and I to put together. And I am going to share one in the Traveling Box of Joy. Um, it is with Miss Tasha right now. And when she finishes, I am going to be getting it back to send off. And so I'm going to add that in there. All right. Then um, she sent me this little joy sign right here. So I am planning on putting some double-sided sticky tape on it and I am going to hang it up on the wall somewhere. And I'm gonna write Pam's name on the back so that I will always remember because y'all know how sometimes that gets. And then look at this cute little bag. Pam, this is gonna be perfect because when I go to Crochet Club, you know, I always put everything in a basket, but my scissors and my darning needle and all of that, my hook fall to the bottom of the basket. So now I can place them in this and guess what? They're not gonna fall all the way to the bottom of the basket. So thank you so much. I love this and that's what I plan on using that for. All right, also in here is this little ornament that says joy. And I love it. And I don't know if you can see it. And let me see if I can find my remote. Let me close this box a minute. And I'm going to grab this remote. Last Christmas, Pam sent me. Let me come over here. Let's see. Got to go over here. Oh, it's hidden a little bit by the mannequin, but there's a truck back there. You can see a little bit sticking out and it says, whew, sorry, not trying to make y'all dizzy. And it's a truck and it says joy on it. So I will have to try and hang this either with it or over here. with the one Mr. Joyful gave me. So, love it. All right. 
And then I have some little embellishment wood hearts. I mean, wood butterflies. <laughs> I do know those are butterflies. <laughs> All right. And this goes on a glass and it says, today I choose joy. And I really like that. So now I'm going to go find the perfect glass to put that on. So y'all keep watching for that. And then here are a bunch of stickers that I can use on projects or my cards that I send out. But look, it's got joy. Isn't that great? And then it's got faith, hope, forgiveness, we love, sweet, blessing, exo, best time, life, family, love begins at home forever, laughter, hug, I love mom, life, love it. And then look, I gotta be creative. It's a magnet. And also it will stick right here on my stand. Look at that. And I got Pam smiling at me. All right. And one more cute little ornament that says joy. I love it. And look, look what's on the back, you guys. Plaid. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Isn't that awesome? All right. And then she sent me this journal and look, choose love. I love it. I love it. And she did write inside of it, but I'm going to keep that to myself. It was kind of a personal note, so I'm going to leave it there. But, oh my gosh, isn't that beautiful? And so that'll be great for either a prayer journal or um, my little devotions that I want to put little special thoughts and scripture in. And there is another little thing of stickers. And these are Christmas stickers. And that's okay. Because I love putting stickers on cards. And so I will use these next Christmas on my Christmas cards. And then the last thing in the box is a composition book. And so I have purposely left this for last because this, I mean, all of this touched my heart. Obviously, it had Cynthia written all over it from butterflies to joy, but this touched me the most. And the reason being is because for movie night, I have to use so many composition journals for keeping score for writing movie questions down in. And so I go through quite a bit of these. And so the fact that Pam listened and she heard that and then sent me this composition notebook, that touched me. That touched me because that lets me know that she is definitely a part of my lives, my videos, and she is paying attention to, you know, some of the needs for my channel. And so that to me just screams support, love, and friendship. So Pam, thank you so much for this wonderful unboxing or this wonderful box of goodies. And thank all of you for coming in and watching me as I unbox this. And now I'm going to leave you to whatever you were doing and I'm going to go enjoy my goodies. So I love you. Be joyful. Stay crafty in your own way. Make your own joyful creations and above everything else. Remember you are loved. Nugs and joy. Bye.